Hey, what's going on everybody and welcome back to Dying Light. This is the side quest health potion and you get this from Rupert the gunsmith. Or Rupert, as we can just call him. So there are two uh, farmery, farmeries? Pharmacies that we need to go check for some insulin. Now I'm going to start with the southernmost pharmacy because you have to, it'll, the, uh, 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 English is hard. So the insulin will always appear at the second pharmacy you check, never the first one. So you can choose which one you want to be your second pharmacy. I chose the, so I'm going to start with the southernmost pharmacy because the northern pharmacy has the next objective after finding the insulin. So it's just a lot shorter to check the southern pharmacy first and then the northern one because then the next objective will be up in the northern one. Does that make sense? I hope that's making sense. If not, just watch the video. You'll see. So to get into the southern pharmacy, we have to take out a few of Ryze's men. Once you're done with that and taking care of the uh, resulting virals, your best bet is to take out a viral, and then when you have a brief second, grab some camouflage. If you don't have camouflage by this point, what are you doing? Where are you spending those points? You should have camouflage, at least the basic camouflage ability. And use that, because virals are just going to keep spawning from nearby. So it makes it a lot easier to pick this lock, if you have some camouflage on. Once you have the door open, you can close it behind you, so you'll be nice and safe. So there's no worries. Now just search everything. Check lockers, check um, any med kits like up on the wall. Uh, no, not med kits, first aid kits up on the wall. Check these little hospital refrigerator things. Check everything until the objective goes away. I don't see any insulin. All right, once he says that line, you are good to go. We're gonna head on to the Northern Pharmacy. Alright, so up at the Northern Pharmacy, this is where our, the insulin is going to be hiding. For me, anyway, if you started with the Southern one. I hope that still makes sense. That's That's been bothering me. Anyway, we're going to use basically the same strategy. Kill a zombie, get some camouflage, and sneak on in. So again, the door is going to be locked, but it should be an easy lock pick, so... Nothing to worry yourself about. And again, close the door behind you so you'll be nice and safe when your camouflage wears off. And again, just search everything. Anything that looks like it may involve medical supplies of some kind. Just start searching it all. All right, and then you're going to make a quick call to Troy and talk to some people. There's a bunch of kids in the magic fortress. Did you know about this? It's news to me. We thought that place was empty. So this is why we stayed, or this is why we made the... Where the fuck did that zombie come from? Anyway, this is why we, uh, checked the northern pharmacy last. You're going to have to search this uh, computer here on the, in this back room. Man, I am struggling with words today. I apologize. Thanks, Troy. Out. So check the computer. This will set up your next objective. So go ahead and head on outside. But there is a receipt here for insulin sold to someone named Ekram Bozkurt. That ring a bell? That's Isla's father. Alright, so make your way over to his apartment. I think it's an apartment? Whatever. So you're going to have to do some tricky climbing to get into this guy's place. And, <clears throat> excuse me, man. So some of Ryze's men are going to be down here. I don't know if they're always down here or if I just happen to time out. 
I don't remember them being there the first time around, but I could be wrong. Luckily, there's also a few zombies, so this guy got distracted. Oh wait, these aren't Rises men anymore, are they? They're refugees. It's the same problem. I mean. Alright, so I started to have a bunch of virals coming after me, so I decided to grab some camouflage. However you want to do it, we need to start climbing up the inside of this little area here. I don't know, what is this called? What would you call this place? I don't know. You should have the grappling hook by now, just grapple your way up here. If you don't, you're gonna have to slowly make your way around. It's not difficult, it just takes a while. Now once you're inside here, there is a lot of stuff we can loot. A lot of things, so... I'm gonna take care of that later. First off, we got two virals here. I'm still camouflaged, I didn't even realize it, but I am. Makes fighting them a little easier. Alright, and then once they're both down, you can go looting everything if you want. So long as you check the fridge before you leave. Oh, and I did forget one zombie here. It's hiding on the floor. Sneaky bastard. Alright, so like I said, the, there's going to be a note on the fridge. You need to check that to continue the mission. Rika, I'm driving to the pharmacy to get Alia's medication, then to Farhad Pizzeria, and then I'll pick up Alia from daycare. We should be home with dinner by six. We love you, my darling, Ekram. So he got to the pharmacy, but he never picked up his daughter. Rupert, where's Farhad Pizzeria? What? Just get me the address. It's near the Magic Fortress on Mercantile Street. So off to the pizzeria we go! So this place is going to have a ton of zombies hanging out in front. Zombies love pizza, common fact. So again, easiest strategy here is use camouflage. If you don't have camouflage, fireworks work pretty well here. You just throw a few of those, just so long as you get them away from the, uh, from the main entrance. So this guy came out of nowhere. Thanks, buddy. So once the place is clear, just head on inside and you'll find a dead body laying here. That's the guy you need to search. Grab the insulin from him and head on back to Rupert. And that is the mission health potion. As always, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please feel free to let me know. I'd be happy to help you out. Otherwise, I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope to see you in the next one. Well, now, hang on, wait.